Missile incoming. Evacuate order issued in the Japanese region of Hokkaido. The North Korean uh, missile is expected to land in two minutes. Get to shelter immediately. Um, what? It's expected to hit land? What the fuck do you mean? What? It's not... There's no fucking shot. No. What has happened before is like when they when they fucking send missiles in that direction, but it's not supposed to literally hit landmass. It's usually flying over the land. It happens all the time. They're making it seem like it's supposed to expect it to land implies that... Wait, this was like... Wait, hold on. This came out at, at 4 p.m. The ballistic missile launch from North Korea has been airborne for 35 minutes now. It was expected to strike in or around the Hokkaido region roughly eight minutes ago. Wait. So didn't it just like pass by then? I don't understand. Okay, so this is uh, obviously completely unsafe, uh, completely terrifying, but it's not, you know, it, it's, it's not like, uh, there's a difference between, there's a difference between literally fucking like aiming at the land versus like throwing it over. And the throwing it over thing is what they do all the time, which is why I'm so shocked that they're saying, no, 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 this one's going to land on land. So, Ukraine take incoming? What? I haven't said anything. Why are you so ready to fucking be like, Hassan, you're going to be in the wrong here. I didn't even say anything, you fucking idiot. I literally said North Korea does ballistic missile tests near Japan all the time. This one is unique because it, they rarely ever say it's going to hit landmass. Okay. Sirens do blare. Sirens uh, blare. They want you to fucking. No, this is not Jover. This is like, this does happen. Guys, we've literally covered this on the broadcast before. This is normal protocol for North Korean missile tests, understandably. There's a difference between whether or not this is uh, a, another one that... This has happened before. We've covered it before. God damn it. Y'all are so fucking annoying. What the fuck? The difference would be... The difference would be whether or not this is, like, actually hitting landmass or not. And I fucking highly doubt it is. Even though that OSINT Twitter account said that it would. That's what's unique about this. Yeah, it's always around the same area, too. I think you got whipped up into a frenzy from. Is this not like quite bad if it does hit land? What do you mean? What? Guys. What the fuck are you saying? Yes, if it hits a landmass, that would be quite literally a declaration of war from the Democratic People's Republic of Korea to Japan. A nation aligned with the United States of America. It would literally fucking kill people. It would kill... What? Yes.
How are they able to know that it launched but not be able to track it and see where it is right now that was supposed to land eight minutes ago? I don't know. Yeah, guys, you want to know how fucking common it is? We watched this last year. This is a video from five years ago from Chris Broad, abroad in Japan. And we literally watched this last year when uh, chat said this was happening and it was unique. Vibrating and going mental. And then there was a, an air raid, this air raid siren going on outside for a missile from North Korea. I don't know if it's I think I've shown this video in, uh, twice in chat now, not even once. This is the third time I'm showing it. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I think uh, OSHA Defender is, is uh, going crazy. Uh, anyway. <laughs> 